Dear plus two accountancy students, good morning. Today in this session we shall discuss the short answer questions in the unit 8th, 8th unit financial statement analysis. Short answer questions. There are five questions in your book bag. Financial statements are prepared based on the past data. Explain how this is a limitation. Financial statements are prepared based on the past data. Explain how this is a limitation. Financial statements are prepared based on the historical data. They may not reflect the current position. Adjustments for price level changes are not made in the financial statements. Hence, financial statements may not reveal the current position. Question 2. Write a short note on cash flow analysis. Cash flow analysis is concerned with the preparation of cash flow statement. Cash flow statement shows inflow and outflow of cash and cash equivalents in a given period of time. Cash includes cash in hand and demand deposits with banks. Cash equivalents denotes short-term investments which can be realized easily within a short period of time without much loss in value. Cash flow analysis helps in assessing the liquidity and the solvency of a business concern. Question 3. Briefly explain any three limitations of financial statements. A lack of qualitative information. Non-monetary information is also important for business decisions. For example, efficiency of the employees, efficiency of management, etc. But this is ignored in the financial statements record of historical data. Financial statements are prepared based on historical data. This may not reflect the current position. Ignore the price level changes. Adjustments for price level changes are not made in the financial statements. Hence, financial statements may not reveal the current position. A lack of consistency. Different business concerns may use different accounting methods. Hence, comparison between the two business concerns become a difficult. Becomes difficult. Limited access to external users. The external users do not have detailed and frequent information of financial results as they have limited access. Influenced by personal judgments. Preparation of financial statements may be influenced by personal judgments and therefore these are not free from bias. Question 4. Explain the steps involved in preparing the comparative statement. A comparative statement has five columns. Following are the steps to be followed in preparation of comparative statement. Column 1. In this column, particulars of items of income statement or balance sheet are written. Column 2. Enter the absolute amount of year 1. Column 3. Enter the absolute amount of year 2. Column 4. Show the difference in amounts between year 1 and year 2. If there is an increase in year 2, put plus sign. And if there is a decrease, put minus sign. Column 5. Show percentage of increase or a decrease of the difference amount shown in column 4 by dividing the amount shown in column 4. Percentage of increase 
or a decrease equal to absolute amount of increase or a decrease divided by year 1 amount into 100. Format of comparative statement, particulars year 1, year 2, absolute amount of increase or a decrease, plus or minus, percentage of increase or a decrease, plus or minus. Question 5. Explain the procedure for preparing common size statement. Common size statement can be prepared with three columns. Following are the steps for preparation of common size statement. Column 1. In this column, particulars of items of in income statement or balance sheet are written. Column 2. Enter the absolute amount. Column 3. Choose a common base as 100. For example, revenue from operation can be taken as the base for income statement and total of the balance sheet can be taken as the base for balance sheet. Work out the percentage for all the items of column 2 in terms of common base and enter them in column 3. Format of common size statement. Particulars, absolute amount, percentage. Okay, students, thank you.